boys get ready. In optimal position, propped up like a cowboy. Shoot, my viewers often ask me, where do you get those sweet Russell potatoes? Well, this is a tale about not only how to get them, but how you cook them too. They might grow on a farm. They could come from underneath the ground. Or you just might find them in the grocery store. If you can't find Russell potatoes, russet might do in a pinch. Well, of course I got some meat in this episode. Let's get cooking. <laughs> Chop those potatoes up. All right, put them in some water, boil them. Once you can pierce them with the fork, then you know the done. Hey, drain them, drain them and set them aside. I know all you fans talk about the cute bacon here in Koi's kitchen, so let's do it again. Use that bacon. Do it up nice. Now, once we finish the bacon, pull it out, set it aside, but leave a tablespoon of grease in there. Slap in some butter. Now get your onions in there. Saute them till they're nice and golden. Once your onions are about done, add a couple cloves of garlic. Stir it all up, let it saute another couple minutes. Add a quarter cup of flour. Mix all that up good. Add two and a half cups of whole milk. And two and a half cups of chicken broth. Now all you gotta do is stir that up good. Now it's time to add the Russell potatoes. Then add two cans of corn. <laughs> have you stirred up, salt and pepper to taste. Now you add your bacon in and some heavy whipping cream. Stir it up. I like to add about three cups of cheddar. Stir that up real good and then bring it to a medium boil. Once you do, it's done. Oh it's ready. ready. Let's go.
My name's not Russell. <laughs>